Hello everyone, I'm International Master Andrew Martin and I'm also a FIDE Senior Trainer. And on this 60 Minutes video, we're going to cover an excellent surprise weapon known as the Gleck Four Knights, after the inventor, Grandmaster Igor Gleck. Let's go through the opening moves to see how we might reach the starting position of the Gleck Four Knights. So here we have a very standard position, been around for an awful long time. Um, was thought to be a bit dreary before English grandmasters reinvented this line back in the 1980s, I think. Um, and they started to play bishop b5 with success. Bishop b5, of course, is the main line and uh, has been played countless times since, with black doing quite well, especially after a move like knight to d4. But recently, uh, since the advent of the computer era, white players have been uh, playing around a bit with, with the position. Um, and we've seen all sorts of weird and wonderful moves, like a3 here, or, or a4, uh, bishop e2. Well, the Gleck Four Knights starts with the move g3. Now, this is an excellent anti-Petrov device. Um, those pesky players threatening to play the Petrov are going to be stopped dead in their tracks when you when you come up with this line. And um, it can come as a great shock to the unprepared because White has got various ideas that he's tinkering with here. It's worth noting that in the recent Candidates tournament, Richard Report used this variation as a surprise weapon to, def to defeat Duda. And uh, that speaks volumes for the validity of this opening. So what are White's ideas after G3? Because it looks, I mean, after all, like an unassuming move. Well, firstly, White is often looking to launch a kingside attack using the move F4 as the springboard for that attack. Of course, he's got to get his knight on F3 out of the way uh, before he can play F4. Now, White's got some options in the centre. He hasn't touched his pawn on, on D2 yet. And we often see White playing either D3 or D4, according to what black does and an aggressive central advance is something that white players should always look out for in this uh, variation these are sharp ideas far from the dull reputation that the four knights holds below master level i imagine that these ideas won't be that well known and um, black could easily slip into a poor position if he hasn't got exact knowledge and you can use this to your advantage because I don't think this variation is that difficult to play. So let's see now how it works.